just wanted to do a little video showing you what's inside my lounge fly mini backpack. Sorry about him. Um, so I'll just show you my backpack first. Uh, I have a video already that I'll link to that my fiance and I did last week where he got me this bag for our anniversary. So I'll link that just in case anyone wants to see what we got for each other. But this is the backpack he got me. It's the Lounge Fly Lady in the Tramp mini backpack. Look how beautiful that is. Oh God, I'm too sentimental for these things. So, so basically, um, this says Lady in the Tramp here and it's in like this shiny material. And then as you can see, they have a string of spaghetti there. And that is actually a little heart in like golden thread. So gorgeous. And then the rest of the bag is like a suede kind of material. Um, so it's like a blue suede, like Elvis, blue suede shoes. I don't know. And then I have the blue plaque here, which I absolutely love the color of as well. And then the last little detail on the back of it, which I was just so delighted with, is this Bella Note. So it is the little candlestick and it says Bella Note there. And this is threaded, which is extra beautiful. So I'll just get started and show you what I actually keep inside my backpack. And I keep a lot of things in any bag that I use because that's just how I roll. So um, the first things I have in here are a pair of sunglasses. So these are actually from Disney World, from the Pop Century Resort. And you can see the little castle there. And these are like glittery. So yeah, they're pretty cool. These are the ones that I use all the time now. I think they're adorable. So those are my shades, my sunnies. Then I have a pair of headphones here. These are just kind of like standard headphones I got on Amazon. They're nothing fancy. The make is Almain. Haven't even heard of it before. Um, I do have my earbuds for my iPhone, but I don't actually keep them in my bag because I'm terrified of losing them. So this is what I have for like listening to stuff on like an iPod or I just have them just in case. That's my headphones. They're pretty good actually, they do sound quite good. And then some mints, how exciting. And then here I just have a notebook, so I'm always kind of writing bits and bobs like lists and stuff. And of course, if I'm writing stuff and I need stationery, it might as well be Disney stationery. So this is the notepad that I use at the moment. So as you can see, it's got um, Cinderella, Snow White and Aurora on that side. Then on the back, it has Rapunzel, Belle and Ariel. How pretty is that? I got that in TK Maxx maybe a year or so ago. And it actually has these little chipmunks too that kind of look like Chip and Dale. So that's pretty cute. So that's my notepad I'm using at the moment. Then I have my wallet. So I did a little video showing off my um, Lounge Fly mini backpack, my first ever one. And it's actually, this is only my second one. Hopefully I'll get a few more in the future. But I bought myself the Oliver and Company mini one um, and I'll link that video as well just in case anyone wants to take a look at it. But I also got the matching wallet with that backpack. So here's one side, look how adorable Dodger and um, Dodger and Oliver are. I could actually, I'll tell you what, if I put on the shades, I could recreate that picture right now on my dogs, but I don't think they'd stay still for me. So, oh, forget about them. <laughs> but that's my wallet. I won't open it because I have my like debit card and stuff in there and it's not an exciting. Um, and then, so I'm always kind of reading. I'm a bit of a reader. Um, and obviously with everything going on, that's still going on. Um, I've had lots of time to read extra stuff. So this is the book I'm reading at the moment. It's called The Princess Diarist and it's by Carrie Fisher. Carrie Fisher was such a good writer as well as actress and just person. Um, and this, I don't know if this was the last book she wrote, but it definitely is one of the last. Um, and this is about the times that she remembers making the Star Wars films, especially like A New Hope. Um, and it's just really interesting. She's really witty. She's really funny. 
I've read, I've read, I've read <laughs> Wishful Drinking um, by her already in the past. So, and I'm, I'm enjoying this just as much as that. Then here I have my toiletry bag. So this is like um, a little mermaid toiletry bag. I don't know if you can see too well, it's kind of reflective, but it's the Kiss the Girl scene. I got this in Boots um, maybe two or three years ago and I just think it's beautiful. It has all glitter surrounding it as well. And inside my toiletry bag, I keep toiletries, shock. So I have this little spray actually that is quite good for summertime. It's this one's by Grace and Stella and it's rose spray. I got it in a birch box and I actually do use it quite a lot. As you can see, it's kind of going and I will get either this brand or a similar one. Although this one's cruelty free. Just, you know, for the summertime, kind of mist yourself, freshen yourself up a bit. Then of course, hand sanitizer because that's like gold dust and we have to have it now. And I have a little lip balm, Dr. Pawpaw lip balm. This is actually very good. And I've watched a few Vogue Beauty Secrets videos and celebrities use it, so it's good enough for them. Then I have two mascaras. So this is just a Revolution mascara. It's not very good, to be honest, but um, I just have it. Waste not, want not. And this is another one I got in a birch box. It's by a brand called uh, Manica Dar. But it actually is quite a good little one. I'd use this one more so than anything. I have my Le Vie Belle Lancome perfume. Uh, the ribbon has since fallen off it, but I believe in my last bag video, I called this uh, Le Vie en Rouge after the movie. That's Le Vie Belle, I think. Then I have a little MAC lipstick. So this is just my favorite lipstick. This is just their little like bullet mini lipsticks. And this is in the color Satin, I believe. Captive sa Satin. So this is really pretty. It's like a pinky color, which is like my favorite type of color lipstick. And then I just have a little um, hand souffle hand cream because I have dry hands and thank the Lord, I'm getting a manicure within the next few days in desperate need. And then next in here, I have a little coin purse. So this is one um, that I got at Christmas time. And unfortunately it did have a little black puff thing attached to it here, which I lost, but it's still cute. It's still Pooh Bear. And that just has some like coins and bits and, bits and bobs of cash. Here I have a mask, cause you know, that's the way the world works now, which is a good thing. That, well, it's not a good thing, but it's a good thing that more people are using masks clarify. Here I have some tablets. These are just like little um, tablets to kind of help your stomach feel better and they're like little vitamins. Here I have a little tin. So this tin is, is Little Mermaid obviously and it says the seaweed is always greener in somebody else's lake and this is a tin that I keep tablets in. It's like painkillers and stuff. So I just have some like paracetamol and Yorkin. Just, you know, just in case you feel sick. This is a little pocket mirror that I got. Um, I just, I'm keeping it in this little glittery bag. And this is a little pocket mirror that I got in a villain's box from Instagram. And look who's on it. It's your boy Hades. How cute is that? So yeah, I just keep that in here and it's pretty handy. It's a pretty cute little pocket mirror. Then also in the glittery bag, I just keep a sanitary towel because just in case, I have a nail file, which I'm clearly not using at the moment because my nails are in bits. And then I just have a pen. So that's what I keep in my backpack. I don't think there's anything else in there. Nope, but as you can see, like you can get a ton inside of one of these. Like, I mean, that looks small, but that's roughly the size or a little bit bigger than a backpack. Not a backpack, a handbag. So, yeah, I think it's pretty cool. Um, and I'm pretty happy with it. So thanks so much for watching. I hope you're taking care of yourselves and bye.